You can model the situation in the solve it with the inequality 238 plus x is greater than or equal to 270, where x represents the number of electoral votes needed. You can find its solutions using one of the properties of inequality. Applying the properties of inequality produces an equivalent inequality. Equivalent inequalities are inequalities that have the same solutions. A key concept, the addition property of equality. Great to add to your notes. In words, we can say let A, B, and C be real numbers. If A is greater than B, then A plus C is greater than B plus C. If A is less than B, then A plus C will also be less than B plus C. And this is also true for greater than or equal to, as well as less than or equal to. We'll take a look at the examples on the right. 5 is greater than 4, so 5 plus 3 is greater than 4 plus 3. Negative 2 is less than 0, so negative 2 plus 1 is less than 0 plus 1. And with the diagram, we'll actually take a look at the next slide. B plus C is still less than A plus C. Problem 1, using the addition property of equality. What are the solutions of x minus 15 is greater than negative 12? Graph the solutions. So you'll notice that a lot with, um, with items in this lesson. First you ask, what are the solutions? And that's really like isolate the variable. So our first task is to isolate x and then to graph the solutions. In this case, we have x minus 15 is greater than negative 12. So we're going to, to uh, add 15 to both sides of the inequality to find x is greater than 3. To graph that, relying on some things we learned during the last lesson, we'll use an open dot at 3 because we're not including the value 3 in our solution set, but we are including all real numbers greater than 3, so the arrow points to the right. Below it says, in problem 1, how can you check that the final inequality, x is greater than 3, describes the solutions of the original inequality, the one we started with? The original inequality has infinitely many solutions, so you can't check them all. However, you can verify that the final inequality is correct by checking its end point and the direction of the inequality symbol. We're going to do that in problem 2. Your turn. What are the solutions? of n minus 5 is less than negative 3. Then graph the solutions. 